it's game day. It's game day. Saints v Geelong. Uh, Geelong. If there's a side you ever want to beat, it's Geelong. And we've done that so far this year. But to beat Geelong twice in a season is just as good as anything else. Bar a grand final, maybe, of course. Um, it's a big game for the Saints to make finals. We've got three tough games. Geelong, Sydney. Oh, sorry. It's Geelong, Brisbane, then Sydney. Uh, we'll probably have to win two of the next three. Um, hopefully, we can start with tonight at GMHBA at that uh, stadium that no one wants to turn up at. Um, but I will be turning up there tonight, and uh, hopefully, we can get the chocolates, and uh, hopefully, we can withstand the 25 people that Geelong will have on field this week. <laughs> Joel Selwood, Duckwood's not playing, so he's been managed again. Um but, yeah, hopefully Maxi King can kick a few. Dan Butler can continue his good form as of late. Jack Steele, Brad Crouch, who's having a great season. He's Brad Crouch. Uh, Jack Sinclair, hopefully can continue his good form. Hopefully, with Dougal Howard back and playing in game 100, we can minimise the impact of Tom, Tom Hawkins and Jeremy Cameron because that will be the key for me. As of right now, Geelong are playing the two rucks, Segler and Stanley. Hopefully, Tommy Campbell's a late in, but if he's not... Um, Maybe question marks, but um, let's see how we go to the stadium tonight in Geelong. Come on, Saints, lift your game and do it for us. Because there'll be nothing better than beating Geelong twice. Come on, Saints! Down by 10 points at half time. Uh, not a bad second quarter. The first quarter was average, but it seems to be the scoring in. We'll see what happens. Well, what can I say, guys? I don't know. Third quarter was shit. And that was pretty much the game right there. And uh, the players checked out. They gave up. No plan B from Brett Radden. Surprise, surprise again. When it gets tough, they go missing. And his coaching skills are abysmal. They are absolutely garbage. No plan B, Rats. What do you think? Not playing Tom Campbell? Playing two rucks? You've done it all you and Ryder and Marshall in. But Campbell not good enough for you. Pathetic. Lena, why did he not play? And why did some of the people that did play play? Unbelievable. Brad Hill should be dropped. For someone that's on big money... And someone that his ball use is meant to be his biggest asset. Well, it's his worst asset at the moment, and it's costing us dearly. Um, still a mathematical chance for finals. Hopefully, Brisbane can win against Carlton, um, and that Richmond lose at least one of the next two games as well. Uh, and we obviously would have to beat the Lions and the Swans of Marvel in the next two weeks. Mm. St Kilda and Brett, Brett Ratton and St Kilda seem to have checked out.